The new CAT M-Series small wheelers are packed with features to make your work easy. Let's have a look at some of those new features together. Come on in. To bring real-time information to your fingertips, the M-Series small wheelers feature an optional secondary display, which can be customized to meet your individual operator needs. Any one of 22 different languages, English units, metric units, day mode, night mode. It's even got an integrated help button, which is going to allow you to get the most out of your new M-Series small wheeler. Come on in and let's have a look at how to navigate that secondary display together. Now let's have a look at how to navigate the optional secondary display in the M-Series small wheel loaders. Now we've laid them out with visual icons down the vertical axis, which have got corresponding buttons next to the icons. If you would like to make that choice, you simply push on the button next to the icon of interest to navigate through the display. We've also got vertical and horizontal navigation keys, which allow you to find the appropriate feature setting and make that choice to customize the feel of this machine. Now, my favorite button on this new optional display is the help button. By choosing help and then choosing one of the features off the soft touch button panel that you need more help on, it will give you a description of what that feature is. It will show you through the light codes what the lights mean when they're on and off, as well as deeper push and hold functionality to the various settings and how you make those customized settings with this family of M-Series small wheel loaders. Now the secondary display has got various home screens which you can easily navigate through using the vertical keys. So the main home screen is gonna give you engine speed, ground speed, direction, as well as fuel levels. But you can also get machine vitals as well as fuel information, remaining time until fuel needs to be filled, lifetime fuel burn average, as well as current job, which you can reset so that you can track your fuel burn over a shift or over a demonstration. We've also got engine, oil, and trans temperatures, as well as charge air cooler. The settings that you have customized to meet your individual application requirements, as well as some of the machine vitals in the engine and the electrical systems. Now, to allow the M-Series small wheel loader to speak directly to you, the operator, we recommend that you customize the language and the units to meet your personal preference. Now, into the secondary display, we can choose the display down to the language, and we can make that choice. We can just as easily navigate to the units, and we can make that choice. As an example, we're currently on metric. We can choose English. And when we go back to our home screen, you'll see that those units have been changed, not just on the home screen, but globally throughout all of the features. Now the soft touch buttons are integrated with the secondary display to help you quickly get the most out of the M-Series small wheel loader. Now a subtle but important thing, several of the customizable features have got white lines all the way around them, which is an indication to you, the operator, that that feature has got a two second push and hold functionality for programming or customizing the setting through the secondary display. As an example, we can push and hold on our tilt for two seconds to program that kickout setting. We can just as easily do a push and hold on our auxiliary flow to bring up a slider mechanism, which allows us again to customize that feature. Now, the soft touch button panel allows you to have those shortcuts, but you can also go through the secondary display. You can navigate to machine, choose settings, and you can come down here to the individual setting of choice, and you can make those same type of adjustments through the secondary display. Now there are additional features and settings inside the display that cannot be reached here on the soft touch button panel. So you're gonna to need to use a combination of both to get the total performance out of this M-Series small wheeler that you expect. 
Visual icons in the secondary display are going to help us with our navigation as we progress up and down through the settings. Let's take a look together. Starting with some of the simpler ones, night mode or day mode, backup camera, home screen, which takes us back to that main screen. Now let's dive a little bit deeper. As an example, we can come into information. Here let's navigate down to the machine, say OK, and into settings. And what I'd like to point out is here across the top banner, it's going to track our choices. Information, machine, into settings. Now we can navigate down to, for example, ride control speed. We can make that adjustment and note across the top, it tells us our choices all the way into that end feature. Now the backup icon is going to allow us to step back one, in this case to settings. If we want to step back again into machines or all the way back to home. So that easily we can navigate in and out of the various screens to get up and running quickly with those soft touch buttons and with that secondary display. With access to those real time machine vitals, customizable settings and information at a glance, that new secondary display is going to keep you up and running efficiently all day long. The M-Series small wielders have been packed with features to help you and your business be successful. For more information, please contact your cat dealer. Now let's go to work.